fellow summer vacationers. I hope you are having a wonderful and amazing time being off of school, relaxing, taking it easy, maybe going on some family trips, but overall having a great, great time. I wanted to share with you a thought about this week's Parsha. Parsha Chukat begins by telling us, Zot Chukat Torah. This is the Chok of the Torah. What's a Chok? A Chok is a mitzvah that we don't know the reason for. We don't understand it. What is the big Chok that the Torah is going to tell us about? It tells us about a person who becomes tame, they become impure, at the highest level of impurity, of Tumah. And in order to become pure again, they need the Kohen to take a handful of ashes and sprinkle it on them, and they become pure. And what's crazy about it is that the Kohen, who sprinkles the ash on them, he becomes impure. Interesting. That's what the Chok is. The part we don't understand is how could it be that the same action makes one person pure, makes somebody else not pure. So I want you to think about this phrase that we might accidentally say sometimes. It's not fair. A lot of times we think that fair means that we all have the exact same thing. And I think what the Torah is teaching us is that not always do we always have to have the exact same thing in order for it to be fair. Each person has something different and unique and special about them. Some people are left-handed, some people are right-handed, some people have long hair, some people have short hair. Everybody is different and they have different talents. Some of you may have watched this new movie called Incredibles 2. Imagine if the Incredibles family of superheroes all had the same one super talent and superhero power. Then there would be a lot of people who could stretch, but nobody could protect them. A lot of people could protect them, but nobody could run fast. Nobody was extra strong. The point is that we all have things different about us. And sometimes we sit back and we think, hey, it's not fair. But really, it is fair. Each person's talents help somebody else. That's the chok of the Torah, is that we can work together and all have everything, instead of looking at what someone else has and being jealous and saying, I want or he has or she has. It's not about being fair. Everybody gets what they need. That's what the message of Parshat Chukat is. Have a wonderful rest of your week of vacation. Shabbat Shalom. Are you ready or not? Are you ready for Shabbat?